Pulse of the Maggots, Birmingham right now. And I'm here with Fraser from the one and only Coltrane. Hello. Hello, how are you? Well, I'm very good, how are you doing? I'm very good, just listening to these tunes. I mean, this isn't Pulse of the Maggots. No, but it's a nice little break from Pulse <laughs> of the Maggots. What is going on? Because you're from Birmingham, right? Yeah. Or you're live, you live here? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm from Worcester, which is like half an hour away from here, but I've lived in Birmingham for like five years plus. So do you know what's happening? Yeah, so we had the Commonwealth Games. Um, they ended on Sunday, I think. And since then, it's just been parties to celebrate the, the Commonwealth Games. Right, okay. It's just like a big deal for us, apparently. Was um, there a lot of um, coverage over the fact that you had Ozzy and then Tony Iommi coming out on stage so with him? So, it was a complete surprise for everyone. Yeah. It wasn't announced or any, anything. That's some so pe- sick. Some people rumoured of it, but of course it's Birmingham, so people are always going to rumour yeah. of Ozzy Osbourne coming out. I didn't think it would be real, so I didn't get tickets or anything, so I no. bummed out. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's incredible that he came out. Yeah, just oh, so amazing. If you if you haven't yet watched the videos. So you've just played already here at Pulse of the Maggots today. How yep. did it go? It went amazing. It was super hot, so I was struggling a little bit on stage, but um, it was, yeah, an unforgettable experience. I've had such a great time yeah. at the festival. So tell us a little bit, for anyone who doesn't know much about the band, tell us a little bit about the band. Cauldron is a, a metalcore band we were kind of inspired by the more 90s, 2000s era of metalcore. Um, and we, yeah, we're just like a, a heavy, screamy band that came up through the hardcore scene in, here in Birmingham. Uh, now we're playing. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm trying to take you seriously. But I'm like, sure, can we keep it down, please, woman? <laughs> um, where should I go from? <laughs> so sorry, yes. Okay, so you came, when did you first come out? When did you first start Uh, dropping tunes? We started releasing music in 2018, still trying to find our sound a little bit. Uh, A couple of EPs later, we released an EP called Last Words, Scream From Behind God's Muzzle. And I feel like that's where we found our sound. Um, Much more moved towards the metalcore side of things, just super heavy, in your face, visceral Mm. metal music. Nice. So what's your goal going forward as a band? Our goal is just to play with bands that we love playing with. Playing with Silosis today is uh, a huge accomplishment for a huge accomplishment for us. Playing Knotfest is incredible. Um, Zach, who plays in the band, me and him got into heavy music through Slipknot. Did you? Which yeah. album? The uh, self-titled. Nice. We went to. Um, I met him in high school. I needed a friend that listened to metal. I didn't have any, yeah. so I gave him self-titled. And I was like, go home, listen to this. So you brought him round to the dark side? I did, yeah. Wow. And now here we are, playing Knotfest. And now here you are listening yeah. to this lovely music. Yes. Playing tonight at Pulse of the Maggots. Yeah. So we want to get to know you a little bit better. If you had to sum up the band with a film, what film do you think would describe your band collectively? Silence of the Lambs. Okay. Because it's kind of artsy, it's kind of sad in parts but it's also scary and it's actually a really good answer yeah that's actually a really good answer that's a really Thank scary you. film really scary film it's terrifying <laughs> it's absolutely terrifying i think burn in my memory will forever be the scene where he tucks the junk and he does the dance and there's the whole oh. yeah anyway um so what is a hobby that you're into or any of your other band members that people wouldn't expect you to be into um, I feel like we're pretty face value. We're all quite obviously nerds. So we all like video games, card games, Magic the Gathering and stuff like that. Um, I don't know about unexpected stuff. I, f- I feel like it's all... Um, what, kind of, what kind of computer games? We all play PlayStation. We all play a lot of like Dark Souls games. Um, the new Elden Ring is like everybody's favorite game at the moment. We all played that together. Um, at the same time and just kind of run through the game as one. Mm. Um, but yeah, we play everything. We just, all sorts of nerd culture. We love it all, pretty much. See the way, like, this is a seasoned presenter right now where I just nod and I have no idea what you've said. <laughs> That's okay. But I, I remember asking you about games and then you just said words and I know yeah. them individually, but I don't know what they mean together. Uh, it's okay, I'm a nerd. <laughs> I'm used to talking about boring things and people being like, oh, okay, I think I'm interested. 
Um, well, thank you so much for chatting no to worries. us here at yeah. Knotfest and at Pulse of the Maggots. Sure. So what's coming up for the band? What can we expect? We, uh, we go into the studio next month, which is September, to start an album. It will be our first LP. Um, Amazing. So currently it's just prep work for that and, you know, trying to push that. Do you want to drop your Instagram, your Twitter, whatever it might be? Yeah, you can find us on Instagram at cauldronhc. Um, and that art is the same across all of our social media platforms. And it's spelt with an A. Yes. Cauldron. Cauldron HC for hardcore. Nice. Thank you so much. Thank you. Cheers.